their various supply chain models are modes of the supply chain because of the huge differences in type of business. The supply chain modes or supply chain models could be agile model which could be much beneficial for specialty order items fast chain model for products or services with a very short life flexible model for products that have high fluctuation in demand and volume continuous flow models for products that have fairly uniform demand and supply chain operations reference model or SCOR model which helps in management of the waste, create some standards and improve continuously the supply chain model. Out of all these models for strategic decision making and its acceptance and use in almost all form of the business, the SCOR model or the SCORE model is the most promising one and we will also study the supply chain SCOR model in this course. SCOR model helps to improve both the micro and macro aspects of the business process and also helps the company to easily implement their custom design or change their design with blend of standard and custom design. So let's dig in into the SCOR model further. This model defines the three elements of the supply chain management. They are top, configuration, and process element. The top level contains components of the supply chain. In the next lecture, we will be studying about the components of the supply chain. There are basically five components of the supply chain which we will be studying in the next chapter. They are the planning, sourcing, making or manufacturing, delivering and returning. The configuration model configures the company's strategy for an efficient supply chain. So it's basically related to the strategy to improve the supply chain. The process element level contains best practices, improving process performance and process element definition. The process element level fine tunes the company's operational strategy. Having said that, it's time to run the quiz as this is one of the first lessons in the supply chain only and the quiz will be easy this time be attentive because the concept of supply chain management could be helpful in many exams of the supply chain and logistic management operations management and even in the lean management even if you are not looking for any academic career or exams the practice quizzes could be helpful to you practically to use in your own organization so I request you to attend every quizzes. Okay, let me take the first case. The first scenario is Mira is an operations strategist and operations director who is handled the tasks to implement an efficient model of the supply chain management. The company faces a lot of waste and need to redesign its process timely according to the frequent changing market demand or needs. Which of the following models would be best to implement? Your options are fast chain model, flexible model, continuous flow model, and supply chain operations reference or SCOR model. I'll give you some time to think. You can pause this video to look for the answer. Okay, the correct answer to this quiz is supply chain operations, Reference model or SCOR because fast chain model is for products or services with very short life. Flexible model is for products that have high fluctuation in demand and volume. Continuous flow model is for the products that have fairly uniform demand. And supply chain operations reference model or SCOR is for management of the waste, creating standards and improving continuously the supply chain management 
when there is a need for continuous change or need for improvement. So in this case, there is a need for continuous improvement because the market is changing continuously. Thank you so much for staying with me in this lecture up to this point.